Hello, everybody. This is your pal DJ. This is Block 225. I'm, I can't believe I've done that many. I really, really can't believe I've done 225 blocks. I I just can't believe it. I really... It, it amazes me how fast the time goes. You know, when I did my 100... <laughs> blog. It was like, oh my god, I've done 100 of them. Now I'm past 200. But today I want to talk about, you know, different types of friendship. You know, and, and I love talking about friendships. I really do. That's another thing I'm really, I'm starting to really, really understand well. You know, some people you might call it like my mom calls them acquaintances that you don't really know. But I don't like to call them acquaintances. I like to call them beginning friendships. Because that's when everything is so exciting. That's when you get to know about the person, what they like and what they don't. And, you know, what what they're interested in and if they like games do they like movies do they like food do they like all kinds of stuff I like to call it the discovery zone and then you go into more uh, learning about them meaning more is their inner self what they really believe is value to them and what what really makes them happy, what makes them really upset, or what makes them worry, what makes them uh, all that kind of stuff. Then you go into the Friendship zone. Like, um, like my friend Kelly, for example. I've known her a very long time. She's in my inner circle. That's where all my closest friends are. In the close friend zone. They know you sometimes better than. You know yourself. And it's kind of scary. Because they know something's going to aggravate you before you do. And also, that they are going to be there for you when you fall flat on your face. Or, as my other friends like to say, put egg on your face. <laughs> I, you know, they, they're the ones that say, they're the ones that are close enough to you to say, you're being a jerk, or reconsider your thought process, or they say, you know, think again, you know the people that slap you on the hand go, doing, those are your closest friends. And I have about a handful of them. But I have my other friends that are further out. Further out. You know, they don't know me as well as those friends, but they still know me pretty well. And they still kind of want to want reach over into the other friend zone and smack you on top of your hanger. Wake up! You're thinking crazy! But they all have your best interests at heart. They're good friends. Use the heart, the heart they have to guide them instead of their brain. Brain makes more mistakes, in my opinion, than your heart does. I listen to my heart before I listen to my brain because my brain thinks too much logical. 
my heart thinks by another means that is more accurate in my opinion than reasoning. I don't know what to call it. I'll find the word and I will tell you next time. But think with your heart and your brain and you'll be a very balanced person. Sometimes the hard part with that. The heart and mind don't match. Then what I do, me personally, I listen to the heart more than the brain. So that's how I am the way I am. So take care and I'll see you tomorrow for another blog. Bye.